one of the this new shavy today. How y'all doing today? Hopefully you're doing pretty good because I'm doing pretty good too. So today we're going to be kind of going back to the 1950s. Kind of in a way. So what do you mean? Well, I'll get into that. For first of all, pre-shave we're going to be going with Phoenix Earth and Accoutrements Ice 2 Pre-Shave 2.0. Mentholated Ice 2. Brush we're going to be going with, like I said, 1950s. And we're going to be doing Marilyn Monroe. What? <laughs> no. Yes. So, brush I'm going with is AKA Brushworks Barbie Brush 26mm AP Shave Co. Cashmere. Not. I think I'm going to use this because this reminds me of in the movie Gentlemen's Prefer Blondes 1953 with Marilyn Monroe. And she sang the song uh, Diamonds Are a Girl's Best Friend. She wore that pink dress in that scene, which actually Madonna actually redid for the Material Girl video. So, yes, I'm thinking pink, pink dress, blonde hair, blondes have more fun. Y'all see where I'm going with this, right? Yeah, okay. DE razor we're going with. I got four days worth of growth. I did shave on Tuesday. Today is Saturday. It is 9.24 p.m. Or a.m. A.m. 9.24 a.m. Yeah, pink watch too. Since we're doing like 1950s, I thought, okay, let's use... We're going with the Rex Supply Company. What do you mean? Well, Rex Supply Company, based on like 1950s, like revisit excellent on like the 1950s and all that kind of stuff. So I'm thinking, I'm going to use my console. So, got the Rex console here. This is what I have. See my number and all that. We're going to be going on setting three. I'm going to try out on setting three today. DE Blade we're going to be going with. So, we're revisiting excellence. I'm going to be using a Rapida Platinum Lux. I haven't used these in a while. This is the last one in this package. I do have more of these. I have a ton of DE Blades. I will never run out of DE Blades with how much I have and how often I shave. Yeah. Rapida Platinum Lux. Ooh, it's hot in the bathroom. I just got out of the shower, so yeah, I'm sweating. So, yes. I'll put this in here. <laughs> yes, yesterday. <clears throat> yesterday was actually nice. Yesterday it was 80, 89 degrees. We had overcast all day long. So, yeah, I was like, oh, now today it's supposed to be like 100. Like, dang it. Yeah, so got that all loaded up in there. Easy does it. Bam! All right. Yeah. Sweating. Hot. Humid. Okay. So, soap we're going to be going with. Like I said, Maryland. What? Yeah. We're going with Barrister and Man Maryland. Maryland Monroe. Norma Jean Mortensen. Now, this um, uh, Barrister Man Omnibus Shave Soap. This was actually released on Valentine's Day of this year. I didn't get it because it sold out really quick. And yeah, I was like, man, I want to get it. So seven months later, I finally got it. I've had this for a month. I've used it a couple times. And I actually picked it up off eBay. And I was like, I saw it on eBay. I was like, man, I want to get that. So I got the soap. I got the aftershave splash. <clears throat> and I got the aftershave balm too. So I got all three. I was like, yes. So this is Maryland. Uh, notes of amber, bergamot, cedar, clary sage, coriander, fur, labdanum, leather, Opop Opopanox, Tonka, Tobacco, Sandalwood, Vetiver, and Ylang Ylang. Maryland is a powdery, cedary descent into what is meat. What it means to feel stylish and sexy, capped with the herbs and florals, and underlaid by the promise of desire. Like, when I first got this, I was I bought it because I wanted the label, because I thought that would just, it's Marilyn Monroe, hell yeah. It's dark though. Like I was expecting, like maybe a girly type, florally type scent. I've read, saw everyone's ever reviews. I've read what it said, but yeah, it's a, it's it's tobaccoy. It's dark. The powder's like in the background. It's woody. It smells really good. Like I said, I've already used it a couple times. So, but yeah, it's a it's a dark scent. Like it hit me like differently because I I was expecting like a girly, florally type scent, and it's not. It's like a manly, masculine, dark, woodsy. Um, powdery in the background. Not powder, like baby powdery, like, like that type of scent. It's like a hint in the background. Yeah, so this one's pretty damn nice, and it was only available for Hall or not Halloween. It was only available for Valentine's Day, but me personally, just sniffing it, I think this would be a nice, good fall scent. So if you have this, I would try using it around the fall. Because it smells like a good, uh, to me, to me, your mileage may vary, but I think this is, this would be a nice, good fall fall scent so i'm gonna get it loaded up in the potato bowl and be right back <coughs> i'm out of luck out of love got a photograph picture of passion killer 
You're too much. You're the only one I want to touch. <laughs> yeah. Photograph. Def Leppard. That song is about Marilyn Monroe. Appreciate Cube. Appreciate Tube. <laughs> I see your face every time I dream. On every page, every magazine. So wild and free, so far from me. Yeah. It's a good song. Good tune. Pyromania. 1983? Could be wrong. I got that album on cassette and, uh, not DVD. CD. <laughs> Old man. Look what you do to this rock and roll crowd. Look what you do. Yes, 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 yes. Got it all. Oh, yeah, goodness. Like I said, it's a dark scent. Like, it hit me like... I thought it was going to be more florally, but I was wrong. <laughs> Is that bad? No, it does smell good. I think it would be, a, like me personally, like I said, your mileage may vary. I think it would be a nice, good fall scent. Dark, though, yeah. It's dark. I'm not saying it's, like, smoky. It's woody. It's, like, got a woody tone to it. It doesn't smell smoky. And, like, on the uh, when you smell the tub... Like, there's a powdery scent to it, but it's, like, in the background. It's not like powdery the whole time. It's kind of cool. But this was only available for Valentine's. And it sold out fast and I wanted to get it. I bought other stuff. <laughs> you know how it goes. And I couldn't get it. So I've been on, it's been on my radar for the last seven months. Six months actually. I've had this for a month. And yeah, been on my radar and I finally found it on eBay. Brand new set, too. It was not even open. The um, packaging, like this packaging, was actually still in the plastic seal. So I was like, yes. So yeah, I got it. I dig it. I don't know if it's going to be back next year. Might be. I don't know. So there's a menthol. All right. Heat up the razor. Rex console. Setting three. I don't even need the Allen block because this grip is amazing. The diamond grip. The shirt grip, too, is awesome as well. So yeah, I don't even need the Allen. Pass number one, setting three. So yes, yesterday, this whole week, it's been like 110, 109, 115 here in Arizona. Yesterday, it was 89 degrees. It rained on Thursday. And so I got Friday and Saturday off. I was thinking, all right, looking at the, or looking at the weather forecast. The weather forecast said it's going to be, it's weird because it'd be like 110, 89. And then 111, blah, blah, blah. I'm like, that's freaking odd. We are odd to go down that that much for temperature-wise. But I'm like, Thursday night, I'm like, if it's 89 degrees, we got cloud coverage, a little bit of rain, I'm driving a Razor Emporium. Because <laughs> I have a 91 Honda CRX with no air conditioning. I know I could probably just get AC in it, but I, I'm lazy. So, yeah. I'm like, it was 89 degrees, cloudy all day long. I drove down a Razor Emporium. Picked up a couple things, talked to DJ down there. I actually grabbed, I grabbed a Carve Overlander stainless steel, and I also got Hendrix Classics and Company, and with collaboration with Strike Gold Shave, uh, Year of the Tiger. I got that set. And wow, yeah, Razor Emporium got some real, I can't speak today. Razor Emporium has more artesian stuff now. They have more sterling stuff there. They got Southern Witchcrafts now. Um, Hendrix Classic and Company. The Miami Lights one. Oh, there's three sets of the Hendrix Classics. It's not on the website yet, though. The, uh, DJ Dondra said that the Hendrix stuff's not on the website yet. But it will be soon. So if you want to drive down to Razor Emporium and check it out, you can do that. They got Zingari Man now. Southern Witchcrafts. Almost bought Boonana. That smelled so damn good. <clears throat> Oh, yeah. Nice weather. Yeah, I drove down there. Got there like 10.30, 10 o'clock. I think. 10 or 10.30. Nobody was there. The UPS guy was there, and that was it, though. I was like, dang. It's a nice day. You guys gotta be out.
But yes, yeah, so I held back. I didn't go crazy buying stuff. I wanted to. There's some Gari Man stuff I wanted to get. There's Sterling stuff I wanted to get. The Southern Witchcrafts I wanted to get. The Hendrix Classic and Company. They had the uh, Saturday Nights. Something Lights. I'll put it right here if I remember. And then they had the collaboration with Rich Man, the Miami one. And that's those both smell good. I wanted to buy those as well. But I got the stainless steel console or stainless steel overlander instead and you guys know how much that costs that's i had self-control and just bought the razor and a soap set so yeah nice 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 setting three is working pretty good four days growth three is it excellent All right. Dang, that's nice. Very good. Try here. The old problem area. Yeah, I go that way, it's with the grain. If I actually do, I can get this BBS like glass smooth. I can do this and go down and it'll be so smooth. Two or three days later though, I had the nastiest ingrown hairs and bumps and, and everything. So I just go this way. You gotta map out your own face to find out what works for you. So very good. Residual slickness. So yeah, let's just do it again. Might be a long video, whatever. <clears throat> yeah, so it's cool down there. Grazer Emporium. Like I said, self-control. I didn't try and buy a bunch of stuff. Mm. Yeah, woodsy, powdery, but it's not like, it's not, it's not that, it doesn't have that baby powder type of scent to it when you think powdery. It's like subtle in the background, like it hits you, like you're like, oh, that's a little bit of powdery, then it goes away and you're like, huh. And all the other stuff kind of brings you in. Okay. Rex console, setting three. Repeated platinum looks. So far, it's a nice, good shape. Well, I got is a photograph. I wanna touch you. Def Leppard was the first, like, back in 1987. I think I was like nine years old. That's I got hy hysteria. Cause I had a boombox at the time. We all did in the 80s. That's how we recorded our favorite songs on the radio. On cassettes. Right off the radio. Made our own mixtapes. So when I was a kid, I had Animal pour some sugar on me. And my mom, for Christmas, got me Hysteria on cassette. I was like, yes, I've got all the songs. <laughs> That's a damn good album. It's still a good album to this day. And then when I got older, the song Rocket, me being a musician... I'm listening to the lyrics, I'm like, oh, like when I was a kid, I didn't know what the hell they were talking about. But when I got older, I'm like, wait a minute, he's actually giving tribute to all these other bands. White Night, Stream City, Dizzy, Lizzy, Major Tom, oh, come on, we just can't to fly. Yeah, and as like a kid, I didn't know what he's talking about. But he's talking about all these different bands at the time. A, a killer queen, Dizzy, Lizzie. Yeah, it's really cool. It's a great, great album. I think I'm good. Yeah, I'm good. I'll just sit there rambling, talking. Sergeant Pepper in the band. Ziggy, Benny, and the Jets. 
Take a rocket. We just got to fly. All right. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> All right. Very close. Very smooth. No nicks, no cuts, no weepers. Setting three was really good with the console and four days worth of growth. That uh, Omni Base is really good. Really good as well, too. All right. Clean up and be right back. Okay, I'm back. Very close. Sticky smooth. Very, very good. Efficient. Smooth. Yeah. No nicks, no cuts, no weepers. That was a damn, damn, damn good shape. All right, so we got the PA Allen block. Allen block, yeah. Rex console, didn't even use the Allen block on my fingers because that's got a damn good grip on it. The diamond grip. And then the uh, Envoy with the sure grip. Envoy and the Ambassador. It's got the sure grip. Got one on my counter, yeah. Sure grip, sure. <laughs> and then we'll... Uh, Commercials from the 80s and 90s. The deodorant. Are you sure? Yeah, I'm sure. <laughs> I gotta know tonight. If you're alone tonight. Okay. What we're using today. From Barrister and Man, Maryland Aftershave Splash. Yes, it does have alcohol. And it's got witch hazel in it. Shaky, shaky. Yeah, shaky, shaky it up. Don't fling it. If you break it, guess what's going to happen? You're not going to get another one because you don't have it because it's not available anymore. Oh, yeah, this is a nice scent. Like I said, I thought it would be, like, girly, but it is no, not florally, really, at all. It's woodsy. Yeah, that's a nice scent. Yeah, it's, it's got a nice woodsy, dark. Like, this would be good for fall, me. Like I said, your mileage may vary. vary and you might like it in the summertime or around Valentine's Day when it was released. But I think it would be a nice, good fall scent. If you have it, try using it in the fall. Make a liar out of me. I don't know. <laughs> All right, and we're also going to be putting on top of that Barrister and man, aftershave balm, yes, aftershave balm. The ingredients, check it out, it's a cool pump. It's got a big pump. Oh, and I use way too damn much, son of a... All right, okay. <laughs> Good job, Chris. Oh, yeah. I'm gonna throw that down there because that was too much. So you need just not even a full pump, like barely even pump that. Yeah, I wasted it throwing it down the drain, but you only need a little tiny bit. My bad. Don't be wasteful. Okay. All right, recap on what we used today. We used from Bear Stern, man. We used Maryland Aftershave Balm. Mr. President, happy birthday. We also used Barrister Man Maryland Aftershave Splash. PA Allen Block. <laughs> we also used Phoenix Ice, Phoenix, Phoenix Ice Accoutrements. Phoenix Artisan Accoutrements Ice Tube 2.0 Pre-Shave. We use my AKA Brush Works Barbie Brush 26 millimeter AP Shave Co. Cashmere Knot, Maryland Blonde Hair. We use the Rex Console <laughs> DE Razor, Matt Pasarsic Razor Emporium Setting Three for the whole shave, four days worth of growth. And we used a Rapida Platinum Lux First Use. This one's gone. I got a whole bunch more though. Damn, damn, damn good. We also use my Put in a Bowl Wood Color, my Go To Bowl. I scooped it with my PAA intergalactic picky there. Picky, picky. <laughs> yeah. Weirdo. So, star of the show today, we used Bear Stern Man Maryland. This was only available for Valentine's Day. If you find it in a buy sell trade, check it out. If it comes out next year, check it out. eBay, check it out. That's where I got mine from. You can see like the batch number. Come on, focus. This is the Omnibus. Omnibus is a really good, nice. Good, good base from these dudes. And yeah, that is it. Hi, babe. <laughs>
<laughs> so that is the shave of the day, ladies and gents. And that was a damn good one. Oh, that was a really, really good shave. No wapers, no cuts, no nicks. Rex console, three, Rex console setting three hole shave repair to platinum lux works good for me. Your mileage may vary. So that's it. The shave of the day, ladies and gents. So hope you ladies and gents have a good day, good week, good shaves. Yes, I've got more to come, and some of the stuff will be links down below. The Maryland won't be down below because it's not available, so you got to try and find it on your own. And yeah, anyway, I'm rambling. See you ladies again soon.